3, 2, 1, 0. A successful blast-off for India's first ever solar mission on a voyage to decode the mysteries of our closest star. The craft, called Aditya L1, meaning the sun in Hindi, now travelling to the observation point 1.5 million kilometres away. The Aditya L1 will take its uh, journey after some earth manoeuvres. It will start its journey to the L1 point, a uh, very long journey of almost 125 days. So let us wish all the very best to Aditya spacecraft. The craft will study solar winds which can disturb the Earth's communication satellites and examine just how the sun impacts on the Earth's climate patterns. Fresh of another launch just 10 days ago, when India became the first nation ever to land a spacecraft on the moon's southern region. A point of pride for India's Prime Minister and for those watching the launch today. These 17,000 scientists are like uh, doing their best jobs and to, up, uh, to lifting India. Privileged to be, in, be an Indian and witness this kind of uh, developmental activities on the Space uh, Centre for India. Aditya L1 satellite separated. A country spending just a fraction of what the US and China invest in space exploration, but punching well above its weight. India has had a, a plan and a strategy that is going to, you know, get a seat at the top table with these major space faring nations. And they have been very successful, as you say. So they've picked key challenges and, and really decided where they can make a difference and really contribute on the international stage. A stage that now eagerly awaits what this solar mission might uncover. Milena Veselinovic, Sky News.